Hey everybody, Ultra Rapid Fire here with y'all again, and uh, and finally we're back on our uh, X series. So yeah, um, we've been in the middle of uh, dealing with uh, our uh, Let's Play Dust and Elysian Tail. So yeah, uh, we hadn't had much time to come back here, but uh, today we have we have uh, time. We got off work a couple hours ago, and uh, yeah, now we're here and we are ready to continue our X series. Um, and yeah, if you guys remember right, if you watched my uh, very last video, which had to be posted like what freaking I don't know, a couple months ago I think, um, which was uh, I I showed you guys how to uh, get the uh, capsule uh, the ca capsule armor uh, upgrades um, to form the uh, fourth armor. So uh, yeah, now today we're going to be going ahead and continuing where we left off. And uh, we're going to be going to the, uh, I believe it's called the Spaceport, I think. I think that's what it is. I don't know. I'm just guessing at the top of my head. It's been a long time since I've been back here. But I think that's what it is. I believe we're, uh, we're heading to the Spaceport. If I remember right. If I remember my X game, uh, X4 game like I hope I do. Yes, okay. So, yeah, we're going to the Spaceport. Um, the Colonel uh, is waiting there. We defeated all eight Mavericks. We've gotten all the hard tanks, all the uh, armor upgrades. Um... Yeah, and the weapon tank as well. Even though we don't need that because thanks to the uh, helmet upgrade for the 4th armor, you can pretty much use your uh, your special weapons whenever you want to, as long as you're not charging them. If you're charging them and you use them, then yeah, uh, energy is uh, wasted. Um, otherwise, if you're just using your normal uh, special attacks uh, that aren't charged, charged um, then yeah, it don't cost any energy to use them. But yeah, enough about that, because uh, not, that's not what we're here to talk about today. We're here to do the spaceport, because uh, yeah, that's where the uh, colonel is going to be lying and waiting for us. So let's do it. Spaceport, baby. Woohoo! Spaceport! Ah, here we are at the Kennedy Space Center. No, I'm kidding. This isn't really the Kennedy Space Center. It wasn't overran by bad guys. Oh, crap. Terrorists are taking over Kennedy Space Center. It's not good. X, do something about it. Quick, quick, do it. Do it now. Oh, crap. Forgot these guys. These guys launch bombs. Forgot about that. And these guys are just uh, jumpaholics. And I don't know what this guy's doing. I guess he's just made to go back and forth for the heck of it. It's like, hey, look at me. Go back and forth. Look at this. Yeah. Okay. Wheels have got to go. Wheels of death have got to go. Oh, God. Yeah. Oh god, this is where you need the uh, devil, devil attack. Oh god, yeah, I'm taking heavy damage. Oh god, oh my god, get off me, go away. Okay, now the now these guys are getting. Oh my god, I just almost killed myself. And X commits suicide. Suicide due to stupidity of missing the wall. <laughs> no, I'm just. Luckily, I didn't, though. I thought I was going to die, but I didn't. Because the way I came at the wall kind of looked like I was going to die, but I... luckily, I didn't. So I'm like, no! The terrorists have taken over the Kennedy Space Center. X, how could you let them do that? Okay, uh, yeah, moving on. Oh, God! Freaking, oh, man, I hate those wheels, man. <laughs> the only thing I hate this level is those wheels. Those wheels can be really annoying. But, uh, yeah, they make for a challenge, though, still. And here we go again with the wheels. <laughs> I was just talking about that and hoping I was going to encounter any more, and here we are. Oh, God. Oh, God. Yeah, this thing is, is a trickster. Doesn't know what it wants to do. Okay, I guess if you just wait a certain amount of period of time, the wheels will disappear, and you can just move on. Which is not good, because now we're uh, down to half, uh, half uh, health here, taking on the colonel. But, uh, yeah, I don't think she... I don't know. I can't remember his weakness particular, so I'm just going to go ahead and use the upgraded X-Buster for him. And his attacks on here can be, uh, yeah, they, they've given him a couple extra attacks and speed up his uh, some of his uh, previous attacks. Okay, here we go. Uh, yeah, as you guys know, we're going to be doing uh, voice acting for the characters because there is no voice acting, which I like about X7, by the way, because it has voice acting. And, you know, in my opinion, it's good. Where in everybody else's it isn't, but whatever. Okay, here we go. X. I had to say that so dramatically. <laughs> Uh, I don't even know why. Oh, I don't even know why I said it so dramatically. <laughs> okay, uh, here we go. Colonel, s step back. I'll s I'll stop anyone who tries to interfere with our independence. 
enough of this. It's only an illusion. You hunters will never be able to understand us. Get ready, X. Okay, here we go. Bring it. This guy is going to be a little bit more tougher. As you can see, his normal attack is speeded up a bit. And he gets a few additional attacks as well that, you, that I'll be showing off to you guys. Like this one, for an instance. This one is so annoying. Because then you got to quickly dash back to the other side of the screen to avoid those. That's why that attack can be so annoying. I mean, you can get it down. But uh, yeah, it's, it's annoying. And most of, the, most of this fight, we're going to be up on the wall anyway. So yeah, except for when he throws those lightning bolts at us. It's the only time we probably won't be up on the wall. Like, when he does that attack, that's when we step back, and then we're just like, okay, let's go ahead and jump off the wall, avoid it, get to the other side, and then get to the other wall, and to do dodge his other attack. Here's the annoying one. This one is so annoying, because I don't like it, because of that. He follows up with that every time. But other than that, uh, it's it's not too hard of a fight. You can you can learn his pattern pretty uh, pretty quickly, like, just by playing, like, playing, playing up against him, like, twice, you can probably learn it by the... By then, like, you'll know the whole pattern. It's, like, not hard, but it just, you know, some of it's annoying. Like, when you first play him. It's like, yeah, this guy's annoying. But he's okay, in my opinion. He makes for a, uh, for a good bad guy. I mean, he's not really the bad guy, but, uh, I'll get more on that later. And clear all that up for you guys about why we're fighting these guys. Like, if you haven't been watching the playthroughs anyway. I mean, otherwise, if you have, then, yeah. And, uh... By all means, thumbs up, guys. Oh, God. Hoo-hoo-hoo. <laughs> we dodged that one. <laughs> uh, we got eyes in the back of our heads. Oh, God. Here he comes with the lightning bolt attack again. Oh, good. Get over there. Okay. Whoo. Oh, God. That's right. He's almost down to, like... Like, when he gets to medium health, he teleports twice. So, yeah. So, let you guys know about that ahead of time. Because, uh, yeah, that can be annoying, too. Right now. Like this. Watch. Now he comes back, swings again, second time. And that's what he does when he gets down to almost half hell, or close to it. Oh god, here it comes again. Go, 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 go. Okay, he's... Okay, so, yeah, sometimes he'll mix it up and he won't throw those, uh, like... Those, like, uh... I don't know how to describe them, but they're, like, uh... Oh god. Yeah, those. Sometimes he won't throw those freaking, like, boomerang kind of, like, looking energy attacks at you. Like, if you're... Okay, he's down to half health. Oh, God. I forgot about that attack. That's a new one, too, guys, by the way. That is a freaking new one. <laughs> it's, a, it's a bad new one, too. Like, it takes some health off you, even with the armor. Like, you still take some uh, pretty good damage. Oh, that's the thing about that attack that can make it so annoying if you're high up on the wall. Oh, yeah. That's uh, the highest part of the wall is not where you want to be. You want to be at the lowest part of the wall. That way, you get enough time to jump and avoid his attacks. Because, yeah, if you're up there for too long, he will definitely nail you. Oh, crap, he's freaking teleporting and trying to swing at me again with his damn saber. Get out of here. This is not Star Wars, man. Get these sabers out of here. When did this become Star Wars? This never was Star Wars. What did Darth Vader do? When did you use his lightsaber? Oh, God, not this again. Woohoo! Yeah, we got him. Yeah, he's good. He's done. Yeah! Okay, uh, Colonel, impressive, but it's too late. What? The Repo Force already left for space. I'm beaten, but the Repo Force will never perish. Sorry, will never perish. <laughs> I had to make it so dramatic because, you know, this guy's being dramatic from what you can tell. The Repoids nation will be born. And the vastness of space. And the vastness of space. <laughs> Colonel! Yeah, sorry for the uh, overdramatic parts there, guys. But these guys were being so dramatic. I can't help. I, I have to voice act this stuff as it, you know, as it is. Okay, guys. So that is uh, the Colonel. So, uh, yeah. Let's uh, go ahead and save. And then, uh, yeah. And then we'll stop right there. Okay, yes, we want to override. I don't know if it uh, overrides it to where you have to come back and do it again. I'm not really sure. I guess we'll find out uh, when we when we come back next time. Um, all right, so yeah, guys, that was the colonel. Uh, that was the second fight with the colonel. So if you guys have enjoyed, make sure to leave a like, a comment below, and of course subscribe to keep up with all my stuff here on Gaming HD Tactics. 
This has been Ultra Rapid Fire, and I hope to see you all on the next one. Till then, everybody, take it easy, and adios.